Good morning, Peter. It's Thursday, October 2nd, 3.15 a.m. Weather for today is cloudy with a current temperature of 17 with a low of 15 and a high of 20 with a light breeze. The value of one Bitcoin is $385.69. Stock update, Facebook is trading at $76.54. Port of Tauranga Limited is trading at $15.86. And now, the latest stories from the world section of the BBC News. China warns on illegal HK protests. China issues a warning against illegal acts in Hong Kong as protesters there vow to step up their campaign if the chief executive does not resign. Head of U.S. Secret Service resigns. The head of the U.S. Secret Service, tasked with guarding U.S. President Barack Obama, resigns following recent high-profile security lapses. Ebola 5S Leon cases per hour. Save the children says healthcare demands are far outstripping supply in Sierra Leone and warns that the Ebola outbreak there is getting worse. Mexico arrests drug syndicate leader. The Mexican authorities say they have captured the head of a notorious drug crime syndicate, Hector Beltran Leva. That's all for now. Have a nice day. Wait for it. Wow. So uh, what we're up to here, we've got our uh, alarm clock project. You guys may have seen it before, but I've decided to uh, turbocharge it, really amp it up for uh, what I intend to do with it. And by amp it up, I literally mean we've decided to amp it up. So uh, why don't we check out what we've got here? Well, this is just my MacBook Air. What I'm doing is I'm SSHing into my banana pie. So there's a banana pie over here. Uh, you guys probably know what that is. It's a, a small Linux-based computer, and with that, uh, I'm connecting to the internet to run the alarm clock, which I'm running through a stereo, which you can hear now. But what I've added to the project, I've added this bit here, which is a one-channel relay. And that one-channel relay is turning off and on this light. So now, as my alarm goes off in the morning, uh, the light comes on, which is really cool. This project is based in Python. Uh, the Python script is available in the About section below. Uh, you'll notice some tweaks since the last uh, the last revisions uh, available. Of course, this is now compatible with the uh, Banana Pi as well. And there's a part of it that you can enable which will uh, let you run a relay switch. Mine is connected to the GPIO here. I believe it's uh, GPIO 1. Uh, which also has a, a GPIO board number. It goes online, it grabs uh, the weather, the news, uh, current stock prices, uh, and it also notifies me of upcoming birthdays, though I won't be sharing those in the source code. Well, look, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, post them in the comment section below. Of course, you can buy, always buy me a coffee if you found the code in this video useful. Don't forget to post your own projects. I'm interested in what you guys are up to with your banana pies. Uh, they are a nifty little device with quite a lot of power, and I'm looking forward to uh, getting some new projects underway. Well, that's all for now. Don't forget to uh, give me a like and subscribe to my page to check out stuff that's coming up soon. Thanks.